across the area last night. We actually saw quite a few severe thunderstorm warnings, and part of the tri Golden Triangle was a part of that. But right now, we're really just dealing with a lot of cloud cover across the southeast, and that's leaving for some cloudy conditions. Also in Tupelo, look at our Alpha Insurance Sky Cam. Here in Starkville, we're a very warm 57 degrees here at 1030 in the morning. It is going to be a very another warm day in store, and that east wind at 7 miles per hour is right behind a cold front that we saw move through the area that has cooled quite a bit of temperatures. Tunica sitting at 57 degrees, Jackson still at 62 degrees, so it's much warmer towards the south as that cold front moves through. We're going to see quite a bit of difference in temperatures. Now, across the area, the 24-hour temperature change, Greenville just yesterday was 12 degrees warmer than they are now, and Greenwood, 9 degrees. We're still only at 6 degrees warmer, and we're going to see that those temperatures are going to continue to change as we go through the next few days as we watch another system that is off towards our west start to make its way towards Mississippi, and that is going to be our next chance for rain as we head into the next several days. Futurecast doing a real good job at picking up when this rain should get here. About 2 o'clock p.m. it should be starting to cross the delta. We may see a few scattered showers here in the Golden Triangle uh, tomorrow afternoon. More of a likely chance of rain and thunderstorms Saturday. This is Saturday morning. The system still is off towards the west and is going to push into our region later on on Saturday. Now it is Groundhog's Day today, and the little Punxsutawney Phil did see his shadow today. And I know it really hasn't felt like summer, or excuse me, winter here in uh, the southeast. It has been very warm, and unfortunately, apparently, we've got six more weeks of that. Hopefully, it'll continue to stay just as warm, 69 degrees for your high today. Tonight, we do have a chance for some showers. They are going to be light showers, 48 degrees for your low. And then as we go into tomorrow, more likely chance of rain with another warm day on tap, 66 degrees for your high. And as we head into the next five days, we do have a higher chance of showers and thunderstorms on Saturday. Puddle Ducky out there with his little umbrella, he's going to get wet. And then Sunday into the next few days, it is going to decrease the chance of showers. And we're also going to start to drop those temperatures as the next system moves through our area.